Hello and welcome. This is Jamie from WP25. In this video, I am going to show you how you can easily edit your entire dashboard menu items, icons, and even URLs. Without further delay, let's navigate to WP25 Modules Manager and make sure it's enabled. If it's disabled, then it will not work. Make sure it's enabled and then save it. Now navigate to your menu editor. And here you can see your entire dashboard menu as an editor. Just imagine you like to change your dashboard into something like my dashboard or my backend. Let's do this. Just expand by clicking on this dashboard. Just click anywhere and it will be expand as an editor. And then click on this rename as option and type my dashboard. And you can see instantly it changed. Whatever you type here, let's type anything and you can see the changes. Whatever you type, it will be changed instantly. Let's keep it my dashboard. And then hidden for rules. I will explain it later. Let's just save it and change the icon. You can see here is option for set custom icon. If you click on this icon, then it will show you dash icons, simple line icons, themify icons, limiter icons and icomon icons. Let's select simple line icons and select this layer icon. It fits good with dashboard. Then click on insert and save and then reload. As you can see the icon is changed and the text is also changed. Imagine you like to hide some options for your specific user role. For example, you like to hide this comment for your editor. Let me show you. I have opened our editor panel here. And here you can see I have comments option. Let me just load again. And here is the comments. And you like to disable this comment for specific editor or the entire editor user role. Let's just navigate to our dashboard and click on comments. Then hidden for rules select editor and save the settings let's navigate to our editor dashboard and reload and you can see the comment option is gone from our menu bar by this way you can easily hide your any existing dashboard menu item for a specific user or user roles i hope you got a clear idea on how to work with this menu editor module by wp25 if you still have any question regarding this module, then feel free to comment in this video or get in touch with us via our support forum. We will try our best to assist you.